This is my close position. Now, that's how I learned how to play it. So when I would try and solo, you're sitting in that position. And again, there's nothing wrong with that. There's all kinds of really wonderful things that you can do in there. But I remember the first time I was introduced to what we'll call an open position or spread fingering. Let me show you this. And again, you might already know this, so I apologize if you do. Let's take a look at this. So if I was playing in A major, instead of playing this closed position like this, Sorry, I'm gonna play it major there. I'm gonna play it in what's called a spread fingering. So instead of playing that position, I'm gonna play five, seven, nine. So the first thing that happens here, we can see distance for my fingers is larger. And I'm doing three notes on each string. So I'm playing five, seven, nine. So now I'm playing A, B, C sharp all on one string. And then D, E, F sharp on one string. And then I move up and I've got G sharp and then A. And now I'm starting all over again.